Welcome back, YouTubers. This is Jason Clark with Jason Clark Rides. points I'm going to make with my uh, videos is motorcycling is obtainable and accessible to anybody. Um, you just have to set a budget, stick with that budget, whether that means that you're going to buy a bike that's, you know, say a thousand dollars, a couple hundred bucks for gear to get you started. You're going to add things as you uh, do this hobby longer. Uh, you know, you may be in the position that you just want to see if it, it bites you. Um, you know, if you're struck with the uh, ambition to continue on with it. You may want to purchase better and uh, more riding gear. Um, so it, it boils down to uh, it is an accessible hobby. Um, it's the closest thing you're going to probably own to an airplane um, without the expense of hangar fees and, and all of that. And it's accessible to anybody, whether you're an apartment dweller, um, homes without garages, um, or you do have the luxury of a garage. Um, some homes don't have that. And, um, you know, if you do store it outside, I just encourage you to get a cover. Um, for a year or so, I stored a bike outside using nothing other than an old uh, uh, love seat bag. Um, I worked in a furniture store and we used uh, an old, uh, old bag for it. And um, it's, it protected the bike. It didn't keep the UV off from it, but it kept the, the water off from it. Where you buy a good exterior outdoor cover, you know, it's going to uh, protect it as far as, you know, UV rays, moisture, um, make sure it's breathable, allows moisture that gets underneath of it to get back out. It's been a beautiful ride, about 88 degrees, a little hot today, but stop, rehydrate, and you'll feel great when you're done riding. I just stopped at a roadside park for a rehydration break. Uh, I'll sit here for 10-15 minutes. Uh, I do this about once an hour. Today we're going to show you what's in my tail bag. We do have some exciting uh, announcements that are coming up for this channel. Um, I do uh, want to uh, get into the whole thing of the uh, uh, charity that we are going to be doing. and. Um, you know, so, you know, share this, like it, subscribe to it, because it will be for charity. Um, so please, um, like I said, click those uh, subscribe buttons down in the uh, bottom right corner. And uh, we can uh, build a channel that is going to do some good for charity. I do want to get into a few things that I do carry in my uh, trusty tail bag here. Um, this is uh, an Aprilia branded one that matches the bike, uh, but it is a eBay special. Um, I think I paid $50, $55, something like that for this bag uh, from eBay. And it's uh, been an exceptional bag. Everybody uh, really likes it. It just um, cinches down to the grab bars. It does have a shoulder strap that attaches to these D-rings. Um, it's two compartments in it. It has been a, a wonderful uh, tail bag on this bike. I can't stress hydration enough. Uh, riding is a, uh, a um, physical thing. You uh, can get dehydrated very easily, especially when the temperatures are over 80 degrees. Why is hydration so important? Well, if you're not hydrated, you won't think correctly. It slows your reactions, and uh, it just makes it more dangerous to ride. Being frugal, this is my water bottle. I also drink a big glass of water before a ride. Sitting here under this beautiful walnut tree and uh, taking a break. I'm going to show you what's in my bag today. Anytime I go out riding, I have a few things along with me uh, I keep inside my riding bag. And I'm going to go into my tail bag today and show you what's in it. This bag has two compartments. One's a small upper compartment, and then it has a larger lower compartment. we we'll start with what I keep in the upper compartment. In the upper compartment, I keep a cigarette lighter, a multi-tool, a wipe for my visor.
Motrin and uh, aspirin, anything I need to take, uh, heartburn medication, my heart house keys, a flashlight. extra lighter. Now here's the big surprise in the bottom part of my bag. Jacket liner for my summer riding jacket. That's an important thing because it is uh, the rain protection for the jacket and uh, also warmth. I keep a pair of clear safety glasses. I tend to ride with my visor up and uh, with my riser up I uh, tend to uh, um, get my eyes watering, you get bugs in them, so either sunglasses or safety glasses are on underneath my helmet. Um, I keep an extra pair of riding gloves in my bag. Tie-down straps. Never know when they come in handy. Another pair of cinch straps and the carrying strap for my bag. Lock. This is for my helmet. You can also put it through the sleeve of your jacket to lock your jacket and your helmet to your bike. Net. This comes in handy if you're trying to carry any sort of cargo. Rain cover for my bag. Being frugal, this is my water bottle. Uh, it was refrigerated a couple hours ago, pulled out, started riding. But next to it, I put another bottle filled with water. This one's frozen. This one was just refrigerated. It's got both bottles cold. Matter of fact, this doesn't have very much water in it yet. But by the time I'm on riding, I'll drink both of them. I also keep in my bag a towel that's clean in case I need to wipe something off. But I use it more for insulation for my water bottles. Don't forget your hand sanitizer and COVID mask. Lip balm is an important thing when you're riding. Uh, some people carry it in their pocket. If you keep it in your bag, it will melt when it sits in the sun. Real men don't need lip balm. This is what I use. Don't do like I did. I left the house today without my mask and sanitizer, and that's why I've added it at the end. So remember your mask and sanitizer when you go out for a ride. You may never know when you need to run into a store. I uh, didn't intend to go into a store, and that's kind of why I forgot it. Um, so, but, you know, that's just something else you may want to add to your bag. Don't forget your hand sanitizer and COVID mask. You may want to add some things to your tail bag. Um, that I don't put in mine. Now, that just depends on the rider, what you need in a particular day. Um, some people might not leave the house without a spritz of cologne in their bag. I don't carry it, you know. It's it's one of those things that uh, anybody has their own personal preferences. Um, if you need it, you it's one of those things you carry on a day-to-day -day basis with you, throw it in your bag. Um, there is limited space, of course, in a tail bag, so, you know, it's one of those things, travel sizes and stuff like that are, are uh, a good thing for uh, your tail bag. In my next video, I will be kicking off our fundraiser. Um, it is a charity. It's a tax deductible 501. Um, so just keep it in mind that, uh, you know, when you subscribe to my channel, you're going to be helping uh, some people out there that uh, definitely need help. Been out for a ride today. It's been a beautiful day for riding. I encourage you to get out and ride when the weather is beautiful. Have a great ride.